Or it could be We the People no, no, of the, the United nine. States of America. Girl Scouts <laughs> of the Jersey Shore. Let's Here they are. Girls. Come on. Make a little noise. And the Daisy Troop goes wild, and they're also along with Girl Scouts of Troop 159. Uh, Did you yeah. say they're also rolling with? Next band sponsor, yeah. Please <laughs> Irish Pub. Yeah, so Don't we found out today that the Daisy Troop 473 rolls with Troop 159 Girl Scouts, and so they, they also, roll together. And they also hang out with Troop uh, 70, uh, 97. Right. Ice. Pride, High School here East, comes, Tom's uh, River. Here comes the Martian Pride, uh, High Raiders. School East, Tom's River, High School East Raiders. We'll try to point out as many people as we, uh, right, as we could see. We are alumni, Vin. Alumni of High School East, 2009. I see uh, the band leader, Chris, Chris Burbank. Burbank. And we have the flag twirlers in the front. And that is the Marching Raider Band from Times River High School East. Coming up now. Vin, here comes some cars. Oh, look at this El Camino coming up here, Ken. Looks like a bowling ball. But I love it anyway. If it wasn't circular. If a bowling ball wasn't round or a car, that'd be it. And a All I know is I love to run it into some pins. I'm Jim kidding. Matola. That is a beautiful, beautiful car. Beautiful El Camino, beautiful Ken. Cars. That's the second cattle. Um, that's the right second El Camino we've seen today. You know, my family is a firm believer of El Caminos. You have a, you have a great one. We have a Buick Skylark. Here comes another old-fashioned type car. Chevy. Look at the condition of that car. Great. Beautiful. Mo Roselli. 1941 Chevy. Mo Roselli. Ken, did you know that 22 gallons of beer are consumed per capita by Americans annually? <laughs> Only on St. Patrick's Day or annually? Annually. Wow. That's by person. 20, you know, Look at this. It looks like we have some wow. war reenactors actors here. You know what my favorite thing about the uh, old-fashioned old cars are? What's that? The fumes they give off. Oh, yeah. Nothing, it's not really clean like the cars nowadays. No way. No, no, no. No way, no how. No, we should go back to old-fashioned type cars. Are you saying that you like to sniff fumes, Ken? No, not at all. Okay. Once again, uh, live with Kenny and Vinny, we'll be at Auto Lenders on Route 37 in Tom's River this Tuesday, March 23rd. At 8 p.m. Only on Tom's River TV, but we want you to come down and support us. Or you be, can tune in. You can tune in at that's home. That's right, and you can be a part of our live studio audience. We our have, first live studio audience. That's right, we have Fox and Lions and Chris Van Zandt coming on the show. It's going to be a great time. We had a great time with Chris Van Zandt over at Thunder 98.5 yesterday. Yeah, it was fantastic. So much fun. One of the longest days of my life, waking up at 4 in the morning. Three hours of sleep. Also, uh, we'll be at Mia's on Route 37 on April 13th, and we'll be doing a live show from there, so you got to call for your reservation today. These are the veterans we talk, spoke about earlier today. And these are the veterans. Thank you very much for serving our country. Salute them, Vin. Salute. God bless America. Jersey Shore face. Ken, you want to know uh, an Irish tradition for birthdays? Tell me, then. For young children, it involves them being turned upside down with their heads bumped on the ground for each year that they're American that they're uh, that is the birthday out, for. Sounds out. like Sunday at my house. <laughs> and once for good luck. Tuesday too. Great job. Here we are. We some more veterans here. Here's something that you should always contribute to. Disabled American veterans. They need your support. Disabled American veterans. That's right. Passing right there. Looks like we have a... We have an historic reenactment coming up, led by Abraham Lincoln. The, the man himself, Abe Lincoln, Honest Abe. It's not him, Ken. Uh, right now, coming in April, uh, we're going to have a pizza eating contest at Johnny G's in Silverton. So go, be sure to go there and check it out. So stay updated on TomsRiver.tv to find out all information about that pizza eating competition. If you want to get involved, 
You can contact Rick at now at tomsriver.tv. That's his email address. And here comes on stage himself and his army behind him. Twenty-second U.S. color guard. We have some war reenactors here. They look great. And we have some big dresses coming down. They're not coming down, but they're walking. Right. I worded that a little wrong. Excuse me. <laughs> Ken, if That's I was to give you a little test about uh, three of the most famous Irish symbols, what would you say? I would say, uh, you want the answer right now? Yeah. Three Irish symbols. Uh, Celtic, uh, Gaelic, and... Uh, no, no, no. Three Irish uh, symbols that are used. Oh. The flag, the... Four-leaf clover and uh, leprechauns. Oh, you're close. It was the shamrock, the harp, and the Celtic cross. Oh. Rope detachment 667 right now, from the Marines. How right now that? we have uh, authentic war silver silver chivalry coming. I'm sorry. Can you get that word out? Looks like we have can a cannon. Wow. Isn't it amazing, Vin, that probably over 200 years ago that cannon was fired That's and shot war in war? Cannon. Wow. Wow. Beautiful. Beautiful cannon. Destroyer Escort Sailors Association, Garden State Chapter. I would love to be the person who had to move that. Here comes the Garden State Chapter of New Jersey, the Destroyer Escort Sailors Association. Love those hats. Love those hats. This is the Destroyer Escort. Destroyer Escort. Sailors Association. That Hyundai looks like a destroyer to me. It's, it's just the association represented a vehicle, Ken. Oh, sorry, man. So I'm guessing that one isn't a destroyer also. Uh, no, no, that's just a Honda. No, 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 I'm sorry. Here you have uh, an SS Chevy coming up. And it's for sale. For sale. For anybody who wants to buy it. Inquire within. Marty Barbero. Contact Marty Barbero. We have a Chevy, Chevy Corvette. Corvette Val Fiorello. And that one is not for sale. No. So you can't talk to him. Listen, listen to the rev of that engine. Sure is burning up a lot of fuel on that one. And gas is going up, so that's not good. <laughs> Thanks for the smell, guys. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know about you, but since you rev that engine... I Ken, Ken. Sorry. You know how expensive those Chevy Corvettes are? How expensive, Ben? If they're in mint condition, over $100,000. That's more than a car nowadays. Yeah, for yeah. the most part. <laughs> Good comparison. Thanks, I try. This is a prisoner of war. Cavalier. Missing in action. That's right. They're never forgotten. Never forgotten. Palomia. Prisoners of war, missing in action. Across the way, I see a man who actually painted his hair and his beard all green. Township, that is impressive. You know, that's not easy to do, especially if you're doing it yourself. And it's kind of dangerous. Yeah. Hope he doesn't sweat, it'll start to run. <laughs> that would not be a good day. Here we have some more... Warrior and actors. Looks like they're from... World I'm not War sure. Yeah. They're, doing, they're doing a war chant. It amazes me every time with these reenactments because it's like we're it's like we're there. It's awesome. I love it. You know what? I'm a man of history. Are you? Yeah, I like history. Is that why you fall asleep in Western Civ the other day? I like American history. I love oh, American okay. history. It's the American Legion Post 102, Linden, New Jersey. And another cannon, or is that a machine gun? That's a machine gun. Shore Army Navy, Seaside Heights. Here they are, Shore Army Navy from Seaside Heights. You know, that is a small store, but they, they 
packed everything uh, Army and Navy related into that store. It is a gr great store. So much stuff you can get in there. So much stuff to buy. Go check it out.